Hey, this is Dylan, and in this video, I'm gonna talk about sharing and publishing apps in Zoho Creator. So sharing apps is what you do when you wanna give users access to a few parts of it, and you can control which parts of your app they get access to, but they do have to have licenses for Zoho Creator. And publishing your application makes it public on the web, so anyone can use it when you publish it. If you'll remember from the first video, we had a different version of our app for employees and for managers. So employees only get to see the form where they can request time off. They don't get to see the reports of everybody else's requests or make changes, and they don't get to access the employee information. That's only for the manager. So I'm gonna click on edit this application and I'll go to the dashboard. So the first thing you need to know is that if you want to share just one form or one report, the fastest way is usually to go to the dashboard and then click this share button. And you just enter in the email of whoever you want to send that particular form or report to, and you can choose whether you want to notify them or just give them access and send them your own email later on. The same is true for reports. You just click on the share button. Now, the other option that we have, I'm going to go back over to the forms here, is publishing. So publishing makes that part of your app public on the web. Anyone can access it, and search engines can also crawl it. So that's not always the best option for some people, but if you didn't want to have a bunch of different users for our application, you could just publish the vacation request form by clicking this link. So there's a publish URL and an embed URL. If you wanted to put this on your own website that already exists, you could just copy this and paste it into the code. You can also change some of the options to control how this looks when you embed this on the web. You can adjust the field sizes or get rid of some of the labels, like the header there, if you wanted to. And you can even control the success message when someone submits it. So once you're done with all those settings, you would just hit publish and you're done. So right now this isn't published yet. This is just the preview of what it would look like. So I'm gonna show you how to share this with users and give different users access to different parts of your application. So to do that, you would go to the settings for your whole application over on the left here, and then go to the share settings. So the first thing you do is invite users and you have to choose which parts of your app you're inviting them to. So if you check the box up here, this will automatically select everything. It'll give them access to the whole app. But I'm gonna uncheck that. You can also check a section if you just wanna share one particular module in your application, or you can choose an individual report or form. So in this case, we would want all of our employees to have access to the vacation request form, but not the report. So we would just check off the vacation requests form. And then over on the right, we would choose which users to share with. So you could just start typing in their names here, or if you have groups of emails already entered in your Zoho account, you could share with groups right there. And then if you click edit email content, you can change the message that gets sent to people when you send out your invite. Now for the manager, probably what you'd wanna do is give access to the whole app. So you would check this and then type in the manager's email and the user's box and hit share now. And there's one other way to share applications. And this is if you have multiple people that are working together to build the application. So to do that, you go into the general settings and then down here, we have this option called choose developer. So you can just click add developer and then enter in their email address right here and click done. So right now you're, you can only have one developer per application. That means both of you will be able to go into your application, delete fields, change the settings. That's complete control. The way that I was showing you just a second ago doesn't give people access to editing your application, it only gives them access to using the forms and reports. After you choose your developer, make sure you hit save here, it's easy to forget that. 
And that's all you need to know about sharing apps in Creator.